Talks are underway to end a lengthy and bitter dispute at the Greyhound Recycling Company in Dublin. On his way into the Labour Relations Commission this afternoon, the company's owner said wages would form part of the discussions. Our finance correspondent, Brian O'Donovan, has been watching developments. Well, the talks here at the Labour Relations Commission got underway at half past two this afternoon. Now, there were some optimistic soundings from both sides as they arrived, but it has to be said this is a very bitter dispute. It's been dragging on now for 12 weeks. It all began back in June when Greyhound tried to impose pay cuts of up to 35% on its workers. 78 of its staff went on strike and have been picketing outside Greyhound depots ever since. Greyhound says that illegal blockading of trucks is going on and that its trucks cannot collect bins and that this could cause a waste crisis in Dublin. SIP2 says its members are not involved in any illegal blockading. Here's what both sides had to say as they arrived at today's talks. Well, we'd just like to say and um, we call on um, all the SIP2 strikers and protesters to stop the illegal blockading that's currently going on at the Greyhound facility and other facilities. Uh, it's causing a waste crisis in Dublin City. There's about 140,000 householders going to be affected by this. The LRC has recommended that we um, engage in the talks with no illegal activity and that's what we'd like to do and that's what we call on everyone to do. We're here to try and do a deal that will bring the, the, to an end the 12 week lockout of these employees. What would it take? Total restoration of the old pay or maybe just a rollback on the cuts? I can't say at the minute. We have to see uh, what the positions are when we go in there. I mean, we haven't got a final position. We're willing to sit down and negotiate and come to a, a, a settlement. But uh, it has to be a fair settlement across the board. Simple as. Now Greyhound says that the bin collectors facing wage cuts are currently being paid 60% more than the industry average and are among the best paid bin collectors in Europe and that even after these cuts those bin collectors would still be paid above the industry average. However on his way into the talks today the chief executive of Greyhound Michael Buckley said that the issue of pay cuts would be on the table as part of these negotiations something which SIP2 has welcomed.